Dobby replies a Rafai after he claimed that he was arrested and detained by him in Alhambra State. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Please subscribe to our channel. To get notified or post hot juicy news updates, please click on the notification bell. The Labour Party presidential candidate Peter B. while addressing the Arawa Joint Youth Committee, reacted to the claim that he arrested and detained Malam Nasser Rafai in Anambra State when he came to the state for the by-election. According to the claim, Malam Nasser Rafai stated that in 2013, Peter B. got him arrested and detained for 48 hours in Anambra, adding that he is now the governor of Cardinal State and Peter B. is coming to Kaduna. Peter B. said that he had no hand in his arrest and detention, adding that the state commissioner of police was responsible for his arrest. According to him, the police commissioner that was there then was from Adawa State and the AIG was from Nasarawa. The GMB that was planning for that election was from Kano. There is no way I could have done that. My chairman, I never asked anyone to arrest you. As governor of Anambra State, I have the first APC best policeman in Nigeria and he is from Kano. I have the first AIG policeman in Nigeria and he's from Kano. So where will I give the order and tell the man who lives in my house every day that I want to deal with those people? And he will say yes. Okay, Peter B don't come outside come he don't come outside come talk. You know this has really been going on for a long while. You know, I think two weeks ago um Bashar Ahmed and you know came out and said some things about Peter B arresting his father you know, a lot of people are saying, oh, when did the father come? It was during an election. What did he come to do? Now, Peter B is coming to say that he did not have a hand in his arrest. Okay? He's saying that it's not possible that a combination of police and a lot of top, top police officers in the state then, they were all northerners. So how is it possible that he will say, okay, detain this person? And they will agree. Huh? We'll make sure they see how those matter they go, share. All right, look at how he's taking like he's talking like a saint. You have a bad hidden agenda to Muslims. I don't understand. There's a religion that kept Nigeria where we are, where we are today the religion of killing, stealing, and destruction. If you have no hand in the rest, what did you do to get him released? You were the chief security officer of Anambra State when you were governor of the state. Does the police take order from the governor or the IG? Well, mm, this is where. Police people, I'm making a new vex. I know, I know, go, I know, go school with this place. <laughs> but I, I want to believe, say, um, if if a military person give, uh, uh, what's it called? If, how, how do I even put it now? I don't, I, I don't even know what to say. They don't lost me for here. Who was the commissioner, commissioner of police and his region? I refer is an evil governor, and may God have mercy on him. Hmm. All right. Governor of your state can. He is the chief security of the state. Add that to your knowledge. If you're educated, you will reason with your brain, not with your <laughs> you will reason with your brain and not irrationally. Ask yourself, if he wasn't detained for good, why didn't he report it? Why now? Okay. Good answer. We have federal police and not state police. That is police take order from the governor or the IG. He was not even arrested. His movement was only limited to his hotel premises, so he will not cause problem by going out to rig the election for his party. Hmm. So you are trying to tell us that the people that arrested him are stupid. I thought he wanted to ask what he did. What did he do? PW Mata will later bend your neck. Carry Mata for head like Gala. You go cover your last last. You know get where you touch. <laughs> Can you imagine? Can you imagine a question from a supposedly educated person, a governor from an opposition party in Nigeria, on the ambassador regime to give order to a commission of police? Did not have a long way to go, I beg, Kai. Okay, oh. so in other comments I hear, um, Peter B say, that time, the governor, the commissioner of police, a lot of people who are telling him that, oh, so so people. And the thing is, we don't have state police, so, not federal. Okay, I think it's not getting clear to me. You will say Peter B no go give that order, Sha. Okay. As Buhari is the commander in chief of the armed forces, what has he done to stop the massive and ethnic cleansing going on in Nigeria? Care to call him post black? Hypocrisy will kill all of us. Will be nothing else. <laughs> well, to me, uh, this particular issue is very inconsequential. If you ask me, it's very consequential. I want, I want to believe that 
you know, Erifai knew before now that he did not have a hand in it. But like I said, they said Erifai was actually arrested on election day. They came to collect an item and, you know, he was going back. That's, the, that's just it. Okay. In reality and paper, please talk up what you know and let obedient and let's be obedient up Nigerian Labour Party Congress. Up Labour Party. Was it not his brother that arrested him? What was he doing in Anambra with a huge sum of money during the election? Ah, Katakata go boss with this issue. I wonder why people will get skeleton for their cardboard, eh? Go confidently carry that skeleton as in then go they open the cupboard and they'll make you see the skeleton. I wonder. What has Erify done to save ethnic wiping in Southern Kaduna? Okay. All right. This man called Obi cannot change with lies. I am short of words because I am a witness of this. Okay. Um. Still deafly strangulated by ethnocentric and religious bias. Not to know the police do not take orders from the governor. Dom Carl Brain. Tell Erify to answer his response now. Well... I have said it before, people should stop being uncivilized in their choice of words. Do not be uncivilized in their choice of words. But you get the one we sort of me. You people know that uh, there was actually an incident I read, I think, was it about three months ago or four months ago? I can't remember really. But there was an issue where, there was an issue where, I think, in Lagos State, I read it in the news, that a particular building... A particular estate, they give order from Abuja, and the particular estate in Lagos, they came and locked it down, as in, without even Babajide son would have been aware. And then when he even went there, they disobeyed his order, and they said they cannot. So I think it is not clear to me. You cannot give the police order, so you know fit. It is federal, and so the call order comes from above. All right. Yes, he was a CS, but in Nigeria, police is under judicial. Okay. It is a most that the executive must interfere with the activities of other arms of government. We have three arms, three arms of the government, legislature, of course, executive and judiciary, and they are to be independent, of course. So, yes, the PWB cannot have a hand in the arrest too. It is very possible. It just occurred to me. He cannot have a hand. All right. Do not mind Obi, he's very clever, an arrogant person with beautiful face and voice, but devil in disguise, oh my goodness. Are you really serious? If governor give order and IG give order, who do you think you will obey? Remember, we are a banana republic where even the president refuses to obey cut order. Hmm. All right, on this note, you have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for tuning in to listen. Until I come here next time, enjoy the rest of your day.